While some clothes designers have sprawling studios, Cameroonian textile maker, tailor, and stylist Salaj Nana has this. In a small western Cameroonian town of Bafoussan, the clothes stylist is beginning a tried and tested process. Stripping dry leaves from this banana tree, she's not planning to cook them, but to make clothes from them. It's a time-consuming process, which begins with stripping all the leaves from the tree trunks, then sorting the good ones from the bad. The next step is to go through the leaves one by one, get rid of any that are not good. Then I take the rest and I hand them before I work with them. Solange works at a nearby design store, sewing decorations. It was on the suggestion of her husband seven years ago that she began making clothes from banana leaves. She had previous experience making traditional straw skirts and clothing for special events being held in her community. Solange says she wanted to create something biological, something that's natural which can be worn. One day, my husband remarked how I like traditional clothing, like made out of straw. I like straw clothes a lot, and I made them too. But he asked me, why don't you use banana leaf? He went and got some banana leaves for me, and asked me to make him a jacket out of banana leaf. I liked the idea, so I turned and stitched it, and I did it. Many of her designs are based on popular Cameroonian styles. When she dried the leaves, she then carefully sewed them together. It takes me around a week or two to make a big dress like this one. With the jacket I'm wearing now, it took me two weeks, a week and a half. Because of her unique creations, Solange has become a well-known name around Bafoussan. When you see it for yourself, it's great. It's not like you'd imagine. She's really taken the time to do it and all, and it's beautiful. All Cameroonians should wear it, in fact. According to Solange, the material is washable, durable, and surprisingly comfortable. Perfect wear for the region's rainy season. Despite some appreciating Solange's clothing, the stylist has been discouraged in taking her designs any further. A local hero in her hometown, she has received few invitations to become part of the Cameroon capital's fashion world. Shen Li, CCTV.